What is going on, my friends? Sean Pierce Johnson here with this week's edition of Stomp Ox Saturday. And on the stomping block today, we got some serious fuzz in the form of the fur coat from Orange Amplifiers Pedals. Orange Pedals, Orange Amps. They do both. And thank God that they do, because quite frankly, they're great. And this might be my favorite one of all the ones that I've gotten to check out because it does something that none of my other fuzz pedals do. This is sort of based on the Fox Tone Machine, which if you've ever seen an old example of, man, you just like they're covered in this cool, like multicolored uh, velvet kind of material. It's starting to fall apart and get all nasty and fuzzy looking. The exterior reflects the sound of the pedal. And they've got this really great sound that sort of bridges the gap between the fuzz face and the big muff, at least to my ears but they also have an octave up thing, which of course was like par for the course of fuzzes back in the 60s and the 70s. Well, the fur coat has that sound and the ability to do all that in spades for today's guitar player. And I love it. So throw the pedal up on the screen. Let's take a look at what we are working with. And let's first acknowledge the fact that this pedal just looks bad ass. Like that artwork is really cool. Um, you know, flashing, flashing some bones at you. Probably not what you, some of you would like to see a, a woman flash at you, but uh, you know, get your mind out of the gutter, kids. We're talking guitar pedals, all right? And we got girls watching, so let's be gentlemen about this, all right? Okay, so four knobs, two foot switches. Now the knobs are volume, fuzz, and tone. Now those are going to be controlled via the fuzz foot switch. That's gonna be your main fuzz sound. Now the fourth knob, that's your octave knob, and that's controlled by the left side foot switch, which uh, you will notice doesn't go on, so you can't run either or. You gotta turn one on in order to use the other, which thankfully, the LED changes to purple. I don't know if that's coming across in the camera, but it changes to purple when you engage the octave part of the fuzz. Now. What's really great about this is, of course, you've got all that control over the fuzz sound. Get yourself something really saturated or lesser so, brighter, darker. Awesome, very cool. But it's the variable amount of the octave that's really great when it comes to using the octave up. Sometimes with octave fuzzes, they can overtake the sound and you know, kind of take away from the fuzz. This gives you a nice level control. You can sweep it and find the sweet spot that works for you and then take it on and off at your leisure so that you can essentially get two pedals in one. Awesome. So that's everything that goes on with the pedal. Now let's hear the dang thing. <laughs> Very nice, very clean. Let's make it dirty, shall we? Can somebody please explain to me how like everything that I've played orange this year, everything on noon just seems to be like a great place to stay for a while. Demo over. I had you there for a second. Let's keep going. That's a lot of fuzz.
I clicked the mic priest. <laughs> Ooh, there's a lot of juice in there. And that's just the fuzz. So now let's switch on the octave circuit, turn that knob all the way down. And what's really interesting is that when you put the octave part of the circuit into the fuzz sound, it actually does affect the character. It's a little crisper, it's a little more splattery. Very cool. You can sort of hear that octave overtone start to come in. Now, here's kind of the trick with octave fuzzes. Neck pickup, things higher than the 12th fret, that octave effect really starts to cut through. So I really find that starting around the 9th, 10th fret is really where you start to hear it. And then rolling your tone down on your neck pickup helps too. It's almost there. There she is. So you can get a lot of that octave effect, or you can get a little bit of it. And it's really cool how it does affect the overall fuzz tone. You don't even necessarily have to use the octave effect as an effect. You can use it as sort of a, a tone shaper for it. So that's kind of what the knobs do. We've yacked enough. I think it's time to hear this thing. We'll plug in a couple different guitars and I'll show you some of my favorite ways of using it.
wrap up, I wanna show you guys how you can get just that classic Octavia sound without having to have some sort of gargantuan fuzz. The key really is running the fuzz all the way down to the point where it's more just a color than anything. Crank up the volume so that you really get that like full force going into the front end and then turning the octave up all the way too. That way you just really get all that effect. Not bad. And let's see, let's make it just a little smoother. Oh yeah. have fun with this out all day. And there you have it, my friends. That is the fur coat fuzz pedal from Orange Amplifiers Pedals. Either way, it's from Orange, and that's what you really need to know. This thing is so cool. Like, the inspiration for it, you know, the Fox Tone Machine. There's so many different improvements on that original pedal that are had in the fur coat. The original, if you wanted to turn that octave effect on, you had to reach down on the pedal, and on the side there was a little on-off switch. Now it's on a foot switch. But at the same time, that octave amount was preset. You couldn't adjust it. Now you can. So that's very, very cool. Cool artwork, great updates to a classic design. It's, these things are, are built in really rugged enclosures, so it's definitely going on a board and you can stomp on it till your heart's content, no qualms about it, it's not gonna break down on you. The orange pedal designs are really, really spot on. Definitely adhering to that classics, but bringing classics into a new era, into the modern world, where modern guitar players might not necessarily be fuzz friendly, but I think it's time for all of us to get fuzz friendly, because fuzz, all you need is fuzz, and fuzz is all you need. Fuzz is love. That's really, that's really the truth of the matter. Anyway, I had a, a blast. I would love to run this up against a couple different fuzz pedals just to see where it fits along in the spectrum, and that might be an idea for a video someday, running through all the fuzz pedals that I own. If you want to see that, let me know. And hey, I would love to know what you thought of the fur coat. Shoot me your thoughts in the comments below and join my club today by clicking that subscribe button when you see it. Thank you all so much for joining me this week on Stompbox Saturday. And until next time, my friends, I've been Sean Pierce Johnson, and I wish you all great tone and happy stomping. Cheers. Cheers.